Hello and welcome to my uh, first episode in the Let's Build series on TechIt. Uh, that's why it's Minecraft 1.1. I think I've got the old version, so uh, I might need to update that. But anyway, um, I'm Brad from the Iric8. Um, and as I said, yes, this is my first episode. I'm going to be doing... Um, I don't know how many episodes I'll do, but I'm planning to build a power plant. Uh, this is just something I've built because it's pretty simple. I just thought it'd waste time in the videos. Uh, I haven't done anything else. But basically, this is going to be uh, the main quarry. Well, probably going to be one of four quarries. And I'm going to be building a power plant, which we'll use. Uh, and let's go on to too many items. So, let's see what I can show. Um, just get past all of this decoration stuff. So, hopefully, we'll, I'll try and use as many of these as I can. And what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be using as many types of fuel as I can as well. So, I'm going to try and get uh, mine some coal, have sorting plants that takes that into certain areas um to use for coal power um can't find it on here but there's going to be a biofuel power um nuclear power geothermic power possibly hydroelectric i don't know if that's actually a feature implemented in the mod uh, i'm not very good at tech it but i've been practicing so i'm going to start this off by getting this quarry ready so as you can see i've laid it out uh, just don't know what the dimensions are of this. Um, I'll probably count that for the next episode. But I need land markers. I'm going to put my quarry down. Uh, I'll have to break that. Put my quarry down here. Um, actually, yes, you need to put that down a second. So, um, actually, I might need to put it down there. So, I'm going to put this one land marker here. So this is, um, when you saw when I put the quarry down, it came out with a uh, black and yellow line. That black and yellow line is the default dimensions of a quarry. If you want, oh god, if <laughs> if you want to have a, a, your own size, then you put out these markers. Then you right click on the markers, one of the markers, and then you pop this down next to it. And there we go, that's my personal size quarry. Okay, so to power my quarry, I'm going to need. Oh, we can get rid of this now. And oh, hang on, can I put these glass covers down? Yes, I can. Uh, oh, hang on, wrong place. Oh, all right, just checking. Put that back down and. Uh, um, I think I'll just leave it out. So yes, so to power this power this quarry, I need a combustion engine. Which I'll put down there. Now the combustion engine, as you can see, has two columns. This one is for fuel, such as um, I think it's like buckets of fuel, and you can use lava. I've been told. So there's a fuel bucket. So I'm just going to grab a few of these. Uh, actually, I might. Oh, you can use oil buckets as well to power it. Um, so just going to shift click those in there. And the other column is for water. So you need water to cool it. Uh, because if you don't then it will overheat and it will explode as I found out in my practice so oh hang on let's just take that bucket out of there um, let's drag these into here now um, I found over there earlier and I'm just having a quick look around that yet yeah, there's some water there so I'm going to be piping that up with a uh, I'm going to pump put a pump there and that's going to be piped directly into here and I found an oil source over here as well, which I'm going to use that for something, but I'll probably do that a little bit later on. So, here we go. Here's my oil to my quarry. Uh, I think I need a lever here. To, oh no, the lever needs to go here. Lever. Okay, so put that there. I need to put this away. It's getting on my nerves. Just type that out and put it today. Okay then, so I'm going to go over to here. I think that's all set up now. Uh, let's just double check. There's nothing left in here. Oh, reinforced door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, pump. Take the pump with me. And yes. Okay, so that's set up. Right, so I'm going to go over to here. And I'm actually going to put these pipes underground. So it's going to be a bit more realistic. Um, actually, I don't know. Digging under sand. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll, no, I'll do it. Okay, so I need to put the pump down here so it's in the water. 
Uh, should remove this sand. So this will come down here. This is what could. Uh, okay, it's going down a bit further than I thought it would. So I'm just going to uh, collect all the water. And I need two redstone engines to power it. Well, I think you can have maybe a bit more than that. Uh, actually, I'm going to use planks. So I'm just going to cut this water supply off to the top because I'm going to put my redstone torches down here to power it. Uh, you can use other engines, but. I just prefer redstone engines because you only need a torch. So, oh, wrong one. Put that there. Uh, I'm one too close on this side as well. Right. Okay, that, that comment's messed up. So, redstone engines, let's have a look. Redstone. Should be there. There we go. Alright, put get that there. You need to put one here, which will automatically connect up. One here. And I need a redstone torch. Put that there. Um, might as well just put that on there. Uh, I'll probably put an engine here as well, just to give it maximum power. Well, I think maximum maybe four engines, but just to increase the power is what I mean. Uh, let's destroy this, make it look a bit nicer. Um, I'm gonna be putting finishing touches on later on to all of these. At the moment, I just want to try and get the basic machinery there okay so that's putting that down okay so now I need to get my pipe so I'm going to get some waterproof pipe so I think cobblestone oh it's got cobblestone wrong cobblestone waterproof okay I think you need to put waterproof first I need to familiarize myself with the uh, names of the items waterproof there we go so waterproof iron gold stone cobblestone uh cobblestone i think i'll stick with that uh this is the one i used in the practice so as you can see it's coming up here oh god uh oh i thought it was going to come out the top <laughs> okay thank god it didn't um right so i think i'm going to do the tunnel first let's have a look a bit of approximation about there uh, um, flight. Right, so I need to dig it out to here. So what I'm doing is I'm just going to dig across, then I'm going to dig down and go straight to it. So I'm going to need to bring this across here, put that down there. I'll go down one more so I can conceal it with some sand. Um, I might conceal it with sandstone so it's not like really s standing out, but you can see it if you need to alter anything. So let's just clear this off. Okay, so with a little help from the mini map in the top right corner, I think I may have found my way here now. Uh, let's have a look around. Oh, there we go. I've gone a little bit past it. Uh, um, there, dig down here. This should be part of the tunnel. There we go. So I'll just uh, close that off. Uh, hang on. Where am I? Where's the hole? There we go. Right. Context is everything. So, gonna just carry on this from where it would be, so I can just get an idea of what I need to do. So that uh, day. Okay, so this I'm going to feed in through the back, take it around here, whoops, go, okay, so I need to go back into this tunnel now and I need to put down all of the um, pipes connected to that one, so I'm just going to go and do that, I'm going to leave that there so I can get up a little bit easier, so let's just put these down. Okay, so I've done that now. Um, I'm going to conceal it with sandstone, and whilst I do so, I am going to be talking about uh, some ideas I've got for the power plant. Um, so let's just have a look. I did have some ideas written down over here. Um, probably should have had these out prepared, but 
Nah. <laughs> All right. So for the different power plant, um, I think there should be different sectors, obviously, uh, to distinguish which parts of the plant will have which function. So the primary functions of the plant is obviously to create power sorts, which will eventually light up some cities or NPC villages or something, which I will build or find if it's an NPC village. So uh, an idea I had was to have the sectors, and the sectors would have subsections: uh, uh, sector one A, sector one B, sector one C. And these dis different. Uh, hang on, let's just turn this on to get this started up. Flick. Okay. So the different sectors would have uh, different names, and there would be like uh, for sector one A that would be uh, the coal, coal. Uh, so it'd be a coal mining facility. Well, actually, this is going to be my main quarry, so I might just have it as a coal separation facility. Then I'd, sector one B would be coal transpiration facility, which would take the coal from here after it's been separated. Uh, and then that would then go to sector 1C, which would be the coal furnace facility, which would put it into uh, furnaces for use or into storage for chests. Uh, sector 2 would be for solar panels. Uh, I'm not going to go into detail about the rest of these. Uh, sector 3 would be for biofuel. Uh, sector 4 would be for nuclear. Uh, sector 5 would be for oil. And sector 6 would be for geothermic. As it stands currently, this may change. Um, but yes so that's how it is at the moment um, so now I just want to oh hang on I need to put that up there can I put this across here it's a bit awkward because oh my god All right, well now the fuel's gone everywhere let's just put this back in here so I'm gonna go down to where I found this oil source um, which is over there it's not where I got the oil buckets from I just spawned that in because I'm lazy but I need to put this under. Oh, need to put this going into the ground, and I'm probably going to put signs on these pipes so I understand which one is which and I don't get confused. So again, this needs to be underground, concealed. But this time it will be concealed by dirt, so it'll be. Um, don't know, just look a lot more natural. Uh, so let's get out a sign. Have a look where are they? Oh, just type it in. Here. This is so useful. This is sign. There we go. Get rid of the sand. Put that down. All right. This will be for. Um. This will be from the oil reserve. And this will be from the water reserve, which is just the uh, lake slash ocean. Surf. Um. I think. That's all I've really got time for this episode. I'll be continuing this next episode. If you liked it, please leave a like and favourite or a comment. Um, that would really help me out and let me know what you want me to do next in the series. Um, if you've got any additional ideas, because uh, I don't really know a lot about tech, so I'm sure there's a lot of good things you can do with it, uh, please do let me know. And I'll try and put these into the power plant. And if there's anything else you would like to say, you can leave that as a comment as well and please subscribe if you really liked it because that would help us out even further right then i think that's about it for this episode uh, i'm brad from the arcade and i'll see you next time goodbye